Olympian Kemoy Campbell put in induced coma after he collapses mid-race amid heart scare fears. A Jamaican Olympic runner was put into an induced coma after collapsing in a race in America yesterday. Kemoy Campbell, who represented Jamaica in the 5,000 meters at the Rio Olympics in 2016, was pacemaking in the 3,000 meters at the Milrose Games in New York City. Campbell, 28, stepped out of the race after just 1,000 meters, before collapsing in the field area just inside the track. The athlete, who looked to be in some distress as he came into the bend before his collapse, had reportedly told friends that he had been feeling unwell in the days before the meeting. Officials called for emergency medical assistance and the attending paramedic was forced to give Campbell chest compressions and apply a defibrillator. After around 25 minutes of medical attention, he was taken from the arena on a stretcher and taken to the nearby New York Presbyterian and Columbia University Medical Center. All remaining events at the meeting were suspended for the day. According to Sports Illustrated, the athlete had a pulse and was breathing with assistance but was put into a medically induced coma for 48 hours as doctors try to determine the cause of his collapse. Ray Flynn, the athlete's agent, told new site to Jamaica Gleaner, he is in ICU, intensive care unit, but he is doing better because they are stabilizing him. We were all shocked to see what happened, but thank God, he is doing better. He has his girlfriend and his brother beside him. Campbell broke the Jamaican national record in the 5,000 meters with a time of 13.20.39 in 2015. He failed to qualify from his 5,000 meters heat at the Rio Olympics, but did make the final of the same event at the 2017 World Championships in London, where he finished 10th.